Turaco, Senator, one of the good liberty-loving senators that we have here in Albuquerque, and she's going to come up and explain to you why New Mexico needs to send Governor Gary Johnson, just like we knew uh, he, he did great things for us as governor, we need to send him to the White House and make sure he can do the same things for these, this country that he did for us as the governor. So without further ado, Senator Turaco, would you please come forward? One more time, more noise. Thank you. Woohoo! Hello, Albuquerque. Hello, New Mexico. I am here to endorse our former governor uh, of two terms, the former governor Gary Johnson for President of the United States of America. Okay, okay, it doesn't stop there. Because I am also here to endorse the former governor. Okay, wait, did I say the great state of New Mexico? Let, let's start all over again. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm here to endorse our former governor, Gary Johnson, from the great state of New Mexico. I like that you're a forgiving crowd. <laughs> and I'm also here to endorse Governor Bill Weld from the great state of, let, let, yeah, Massachusetts, but let's say this, not as great as New Mexico. <laughs> but I did hear that they had an awesome tea party so Governor Bill Weld from the great state of Massachusetts for Vice President of the United States of America. Okay, what do I want in a president? Probably the same thing that you want in a president. I want a president who's honest. And Gary Johnson is honest. I want a president who is trustworthy. Gary Johnson was our governor here in New Mexico for eight years. He has a track record of doing what he would say, what, what he says he's going to do. He has courage to stand up and do the right thing. I want a president who's trustworthy, and Gary Johnson is trustworthy. I want a president who is fair. And for those of you who are catching on, these are the six pillars of character that counts that we teach our children in school. Because character counts. It means something. That's why I teach it to my children and the thought that character somehow doesn't count in the office of the President of the United States is absolutely absurd. Character counts. I want a president who is fair. Let's talk about what fairness is. That means you play by the rules. Fairness means you don't take advantage of others. Gary Johnson has a path to citizenship. He has a plan for immigration. I'm a Christian. I, I don't think that Muslims need to be kicked out of our country. Freedom of religion is freedom of religion for everyone. I want a president who is responsible. That means that you plan ahead, you are diligent, you do your best, and you are self-disciplined. That means that you strive for excellence. We have an Iron Man running for President of the United States. <laughs> Citizenship is one of those other pillars of character counts. 
So what is citizenship? It means that you get involved, that you're a good neighbor, that you stay informed, that you obey the rules, that you respect authority. Both of our candidates for president and for vice president have been stellar citizens for their states. And we need to send that message because the people from New Mexico need to send the message stronger than anyone else because we know Gary Johnson, we've seen the record, we know he's a good citizen, and the people of New Mexico need to support Gary Johnson for president. I want a president that shows respect, that uses, I know it sounds trite, but he uses good manners. Did you ever think that you'd be involved in a presidential campaign where that even had to be an issue? I want a president that's caring, that doesn't want the job for power and control, a president that wants the job because he's compassionate to others. That's Gary Johnson. So I go to um, talk to my conservative friends. I have lots of conservative friends. I'm a Republican from Albuquerque, Northeast Heights. I go to my conservative friends and I say to them, I think you should be for Gary Johnson. I'll tell you why. Gary Johnson stands for uh, reduced taxes. I'm for that. I want the money in my pocket, not in the government's pocket. I know how to spend my money better than the government knows how to spend my money. <laughs> Have I already said you guys are awesome? Because you guys are awesome. And I want complete tax reform. The IRS is a mess, the tax code is a mess, the fact that I spend thousands of dollars just getting my taxes prepared is an absolute mess. I want tax reform. So I tell my conservative friends, you should vote for Gary Johnson. And they say, uh, I don't know, a vote for Gary Johnson is really a vote for Hillary. So, so they say, I'm not gonna vote for Johnson, that's a wasted vote. Okay, so then I go to my liberal friends. And I have a lot of liberal friends. Don't laugh at me, I have a lot of liberal friends. Yeah, we love New Mexico, it's very diverse. So I have a lot of liberal friends and I say to my liberal friends, you should vote for Gary Johnson. Gary Johnson has issues that you care about. Gary Johnson is, uh, he supports LBGTQ. You know, you, you've, got me so, you've got me so riled up, I forgot. What was that other legal, liberal issue that he support? Oh. He supports legalization of marijuana. <laughs> How could I forget? And do you know what my liberal friends say? No, because a vote for Gary Johnson then is a vote for Trump. Okay, so here's, <laughs> here's what I say. You guys, I only have seven minutes and I'm already 33 seconds over, so. Let, let me get through this. Okay, so this is, this is what I think. If I hear one more person tell me that a vote for Gary Johnson is a wasted vote, I think, I think I'm going, no, I'm not gonna punch him. I think I'm gonna just spit. And I am not a spitter. So, let me tell you. 60% of the people who are gonna vote for Trump don't like him. 60% of the people that are gonna vote for Clinton don't like her. I talked to the Clinton people, so then why are you gonna vote for her? Do you know what they tell me? Because she's a woman. I am so insulted. I'm an elected official. Maybe that should be my next campaign slogan. Vote for me because I'm a woman. You know what? You vote for a candidate because they are smart, because they are committed, because they have a vision, 
because they, they have direction, they're respectful, they have integrity, and that's Gary Johnson. I'm way over two minutes and now 57 seconds. Okay, so I'm gonna have to wind it up unfortunately, but here's what I wanna tell you. Gary Johnson can win the presidency if he wins New Mexico. And that's... Okay, folks, you read the blogs, you study the issues, and I stand by this. If Gary Johnson can win New Mexico, he can win the presidency. That's why I support him. He's a winner. Let's go through it. The popular vote does not win the presidency. It's the electoral college. He should win New Mexico. Every New Mexican should be behind him. If he can win, if he can win New Mexico, then it is very conceivable that neither of the two major party candidates will get 270 electoral college votes. And that's how Gary Johnson can win. That is our calling. We are here for a time such as this. So here's what I ask of you. Get 10 friends who will commit to voting for Gary Johnson and for Bill Weld. Have them get 10 friends that will commit to voting for Gary Johnson and Bill Weld. And if we can win New Mexico, we can change the world. We can change how government is in the United States of America. We can change a two-party system that gives us nothing but gridlock in Washington, D.C. What's your Senate, what has your congressman done for you lately? They can't get anything done because they need a change in Washington and the only real change comes behind Johnson and Weld. God bless America. Thank you so much for being a great audience. Oh, 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 I forgot another one of my important jobs. Holy moly. I got so excited and then I saw that I ran over time. I get the very distinguished honor of introducing Juan Hernandez. Okay, Mr. Hernandez was in President, the Mexico president Vicente Fox's cabinet and worked throughout the United States for the president of Mexico. You also know him from Univision and from CNN. So it is my very distinct honor to introduce Mr. Hernandez. Viva Gary! Viva Gary! Viva Gary!